It was a proud moment for me when I was able to go to the library on my own and take out books, you know, Dr. Seuss and books on the Civil War. And uh, last night, uh, someone posted something on my Facebook page, and uh, it was, uh, they said, Pat, do you have this? And they knew I was a fan of uh, old, the old Mad magazines from the late 1950s and early 60s. Uh, and as Dennis Dyke and our drummer said so uh, eloquently on our first live CD, um, that we learned more about life from Mad Magazine than from all our teachers combined in high school. <laughs> uh, but in any event, uh, the Mad, every issue is on uh, CD-ROM, and I said I much prefer to hold my old, worn, uh, weathered copies of Mad Magazine in my hand. Yeah. And because there's the smell of books, the, 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 the feel of them. There's nothing like it in the world. And I, I try to explain to my, uh, my daughter about the difference between the times she's living in and the times that I grew up in when I'd walk home from school in fourth grade on a crisp autumn afternoon and go to the library, my favorite place in the world. And uh, I'd kick through the leaves. The whole experience of going into the library and pulling out the card catalog, which probably no longer exists, of course, and having to search for that book and sit down and the smell of the books as you open it. Just a whole overwhelmingly beautiful experience. Uh, uh, so before I begin, I want to thank you uh, for what you do for our country and our kids by, by being librarians. And uh, I thank you so much and what you've done for, for my life. With that being said, uh, a lot of the uh, song titles come from books. And this first song I'll do, which was a number one hit for the Smithereens many years ago, uh, was... Uh, taken from a title of uh, a collection of short stories by the science fiction horror writer H.P. Lovecraft. He wrote a, uh, a story called Beyond the Wall of Sleep, so I, I retitled it Behind the Wall of Sleep. I'll do it for you right now. <laughs> She had legs that never ended. I was halfway paralyzed. She was tall and cool and pretty. She dressed as black as gold. If she asked me to admit it, I would gladly lose my soul. Now I like it better, bigger, bigger. Sometimes I leave it weak Then I dream of her Behind the wall of sleep Well, she held a bass guitar She was playing in a bed And she stood just like Bill White I am her biggest fan Now I know he would like to be your friend And I've got to find a way To let you know I'm not like them Now I like it then Think of it Sometimes I dream it weak Then I dream of her Behind the wall of sleep Imagine the greatest guitar solo you ever heard Called you up to have a drink 